Yes. Yes. You bloody ripper! Hey Walter, your friend just called me. He wants to borrow a thousand dollars. Tell him he's dreaming. So did he say I could borrow it? Oh, spewing. G'day guys, my name's Walter and welcome to Cozy TV. Now since the last video was so popular, I thought we'd do part two today. So this video is part two of the tradey slash country style English. Now just a reminder guys that not all Australians speak like this, but we do have a few Australians that will speak very similar to this. Alright, so let's get started. You bloody ripper! You bloody ripper. Okay, so let's break that down. You bloody ripper means that's awesome, or that's really cool, or that's amazing. So for example, if you catch a big fish while you've gone fishing, you can say you bloody ripper. Or if your favorite team scores, uh, you can also say you bloody ripper. People can also say you beauty as another way of saying you bloody ripper. So one more time, you bloody ripper. Tell him he's dreaming. Tell him he's dreaming. So let's break that one down. To tell someone that they're dreaming is another way of saying they have no chance. There is no possible way that this thing will happen. This quote was made famous by a very popular Australian movie called The Castle. Now if you haven't seen The Castle, I really suggest you watch it. So one more time. Tell him he's dreaming. Oh, spewing. Spewing. Spewing, or to spew, is another way of saying vomit, or throw up. But in this situation, it's more to express that you're actually bummed out or you're very disappointed. So one more time. Oh, spewing. Okay guys, that's a very quick video for you today. I'll be continuing to do these videos for you every week. I would also like to take this time to thank my subscribers. I'm now up to about 300. Fantastic, thank you to everyone. I am extremely appreciative and I really love you all. Thank you so much. I will also take this time to talk about the new project I am doing with Korean Billy. We will be releasing a podcast for English learners. This is called How to English with Billy and Walter. So keep an eye out for that on my Instagram as I'll put the link below. And just a reminder that I will be going to Australia very soon. So please follow my Instagram where I will be uploading a lot of photos about Australia and my journey while I'm there. And always remember guys to like and subscribe. And like I always say, stay positive.